Today I will not ask you why, but I will show you how. How to disable Microsoft Defender in Windows 11. Because after turning off Microsoft Defender in the setting, for some reason it automatically again and again turns on. That's why today I will show you three ultimate ways to disable Windows antivirus in Windows 11. So let's get it started. So friends, we are in Windows 11 and first of all that we need to do is to hit Win plus S and type Windows Security. Here you may see Windows Security. Click on it. In this window you need to select Virus and Threat Protection. Scroll down a little bit and select Manage Settings. Simply to understand, yes, of course, you can disable Microsoft Defender, you can click here, but the thing is, after you restart your laptop or computer, sometimes it automatically turn on. Also, you may see strange behavior because I'm turning it off and it automatically, for some reason, turning on. Right now, it's okay. So you can disable all of these options and very, very importantly, you need to disable temper protection because if you will not disable this option, it will interfere in the future because we will use registry, policy editor and CMD. So of course, before doing this, you need to disable temper protection because it is necessary. So after you disable all of these options, you can close this window. Regarding to the first method, we will use Group Policy Editor. In my previous video, I showed how to disable data collection using this method. And today we will disable Microsoft Defender. For this, we need to hit Win plus R. And now you need to type next. GP edit dot MSC. GP edit MSC. Press enter. And again, one more time, I will open it in full screen to make it more convenient. In the upper left corner, you need to select Computer Configuration, then navigate to Administrative Templates, double click. From now on, you need to select Windows Components. From this place, you need to scroll down a little bit until you will see Microsoft Defender Antivirus. So you just need to click on it only one time. And on the right side, you need to find Turn off Microsoft Defender Antivirus. You need to double click on it. And very importantly, you need to change this option, Not Configured, to Enabled. Click here, select Apply, and then click OK. Actually, that's all. If you agree with me that the first method was very easy, please like this video. And after this, we will proceed to the second method. Now we can close this window. For the second method, we will use registry. So one more time, we need to hit Win plus S. But this time, we need to type next. Reg. Edit. And press Enter. Select Yes. In the upper left corner, we need to select HK Local Machine. Then you need to navigate to Software. From Software, you need to navigate to Policies. Click here. You will see Microsoft. One more time, click here. And finally, you need to select Windows Defender. Just click on it one time. On the right side, you need to click on the rightmost button and create new the word 32-bit value. Click on it and you need to type next, disable anti-spyware, disable anti-spyware, after this process you need to double click on it, it is very importantly to enter 1 because 0 will be not suitable, so type 1, then select this option and click OK. I want to notice after hold this process with registry, you need to restart your laptop and then it will apply all the changes. And of course, let's talk about the last and probably the easiest way, third method to disable Microsoft Defender using CMT. So one more time, we need to hit Win plus R. This time you need to type CMD. And please pay attention because you need to hit Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter because we need to run command prompt as administrator. 
So hit Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter. Select yes. In my case, I will open this text document with the command that we need to pass in the command line. I will leave this command in the video description, so don't worry about that. After that, you need to click on the command line and you can hit Ctrl plus V. Voila, we see the operation complete successfully and that's mean everything works. So we disable Microsoft Defender. If you don't see this message, just try to press enter and after this, it will work as well. After this, you need to type exit and press enter. So yeah, fellas, in reality, it's not hard to disable Microsoft Defender you can use one of these methods. You can use registry, you can use group policy editor, or you can use CMD. It all depends on you. If this video was useful for you, please like it. And I recommend watching this video on how to disable data collection in Windows 10 and Windows 11.